Mendy trend looks like this. Oppressive for today, tomorrow getting better, but still feeling it by Monday. We're almost comfortable out there. It's really good in comparison to where we stand today. On the vortex up. Where we stand today. On the vortex satellite and radar picture. I want to find this young girl. Come on, come on, lady. It's really good in comparison to where we stand today. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Can you, can you, can you hear me? Sandy says, hope our noontime BBQ won't be rained out. Better at noon than, say, five, I think, Bruce. Anthony Lachanza reporting 80 degrees in Plainsboro. For the next several days, and the nights will be even colder. We'll talk about that in our 10 day forecast coming up. Five, I think, Bruce. Anthony Lachanza reporting 80 degrees in Plainsboro Township with cloudy skies. Overcast morning so far. Can we get a little sun down here, please? And unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to deliver too much in the way of sunshine for you guys today, but some. Relative humidity at 84 percent. It says hope our noontime BBQ won't be rained out. Better at noon than say five, I think, Bruce. Anthony Lachanza reporting 80 degrees in Plainsboro Township with 80 degrees in Plainsboro Township with cloudy skies. Overcast morning so far. Can we get a little sun down here? Just download the free Fox 5 New York News app. Please. And unfortunately, oh, I'm not going to be able to deliver too much in the way of sunshine for you guys today. But some breaks of sun. I do think the clouds prevail. All right. Get up. Everybody get up. A little sun down here, please. And unfortunately, oh, I'm not going to be able to I think Bruce. Anthony Lachanza reporting 80 degrees in Plainsboro Township with cloudy skies. Overcast morning so far. Can we get a little? Reporting 80 degrees in Plainsboro Township with cloudy skies. Overcast morning so far. Can we get a little sun down here, please? And unfortunately, oh, I'm not going to be. Yet 84%. He says, hope our noontime BBQ won't be rained out. Better at noon than say five, I think, Bruce. Anthony Lachanza report. Come on, come on, come on. Let's let's pause it. I think Bruce. Anthony Lachanza reporting 80 degrees in Plainsboro Township with cloudy skies. Overcast morning so Township with cloudy skies. Overcast morning so far. Can we get a holiday? It will resume on Monday. Erica Biden is for New York. Thank you, Erica. And Donald Trump's name rarely came up in the third GOP presidential debate last night. Trump skipped the debate and held a rally meal instead. Meanwhile, the five GOP. Ready to rock and roll. Little sun down here, please. And unfortunately, oh, I'm not going to be able to. Here's an easy answer. The five candidates on stage in Miami taking aim at each other and discussing major issues like the war in Gaza. Finish the job. Hope our noontime BBQ won't be rained out. Better at noon than say five, I think, Bruce. Anthony Lachanza reporting 80 degrees in Plainsboro Township with cloudy skies. Oh, once again, the front runner in the race, former President Donald Trump, did not participate. Instead, Trump That lady. Better at noon than say five, I think, Bruce. Anthony Lachanza reporting 80 degrees in Plainsboro Township with cloudy skies. Overcast morning so far. Can we get a little sun down here? Dominating the race there is a wild card. Morning so far. Can we get a little sun down here, please? To begin next spring, during the thick of the 
Republican primary. What's going to happen is he's going to start losing as soon as he spends every... Anzo reporting 80 degrees in Plainsboro Township with cloudy skies. Overcast morning so far. A plant that reopened after a historic deal between auto companies and workers unions. We're here in the middle of a fight. Come and get a little sun down here. The other stood with his shoulder to shoulder on that pickup line. Oh. Ainsboro Township with cloudy skies. Overcast morning so far. Can we get a little sun? I hope you, yes, so I hope you guys have a memory. President Biden trying to reassure Democrats that his message can lead to victory next year, despite poll numbers that show voters don't trust him on the economy. As the 2024 primaries draw closer, the All right. and final Republican put it on has been announced for December 6th in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. Drew Petrino, ABC News, That's... Washington. Come on, let's go. I'm here, please. And unfortunately. <sighs> 80 degrees in Plainsboro Township with cloudy skies. Overcast morning so far. Come and get a little sun down here, please. Like the rock. <sighs> a little sun down here, please. I mean, township with cloudy skies, overcast morning so far. Come and get a little sun down here, please. Oh. A little sun down here, please. Clock. Come and get a little sun down here, please. Come on, come on. I want to. I want to speak. Please. And unfortunately, make, this, make me make it louder, lady. Come and get a little sun down. All right, put it on, young man. I want to listen to this ever again. Oh, oh. Here, please. Oh, Vanessa Murdoch's a potty mouth. Oh, Your potty mouth, Vanessa Murdoch. Potty mouth, Miss Murdoch. I do think the clouds prevail. Although the clouds are not going to prevail for long. At the moment, we're dealing with mostly cloudy skies. Again, mostly. I'm going to watch Reagan Reggie's video on Good Day New York. I remember she left Fox 5 last month. Scattered storms today. Can I watch Bianca Peters on Good Day New York? Tomorrow. I have to watch it tomorrow on Fox 5. Big time by tomorrow, and it's looking nice. For the fourth, the forecast. Mm. The new trend looks like this. Oppressive for today, tomorrow getting better, but still feeling it by Monday. We're almost oh, comfortable out there. It's really oh, good in comparison hey. to where we stand today. Hey, baby. On the vortex satellite and radar picture.